What's up guys, I'm Weekend Warrior, and this is part 4 of my series for Valheim. Man, alright dude, so picking up uh, where we left off previously. Um, I just did a little bit of farming and stuff, a little bit of exploration. Um, discovered everything else in this immediate area. Uh, took out some trolls, so I got some more troll hide. Um, there's a couple of troll caves down here that we got. Got the trader over here, just marked down some burial chambers, which is uh, what we're going to do today. So that's what we're going to do today. Go and stomp on some skelly boys in the burial chambers, but uh, I just had that forces moving event. I didn't get it on. Uh, I wasn't able to record it, which is kind of lame, but I don't know. I just basically kicked uh, a bunch of Gradorf's butts, and I um, refurbished this little home, this little, like, yeah, little shack up here, and I put our two-star boar in it so that it's nice and uh, protected. Gotta protect this guy. So he's just hanging out here, and I don't, I don't really know why he's, like, running around being weird. I need to figure that out. But he's just hanging out in there, and I have another boar right there ready to go. It's just a regular old boar, so we'll start. I'll put that guy in here, though, after we're done. Hopefully, we'll start making uh, little two-star babies. That would be the dream. But anyways, enough, enough talking. Let's hand, head down into the Black Forest and start going after some burial chambers. All right, dude, it's coming up on our first burial chambers, I th think. Okay, none of the skeletons are outside. And this is what my inventory is looking like. I want it to be as lightweight and free of stuff as possible. So, I mean, I didn't bring with a bow or arrows. I'm just bringing with a spear. And that's because, I mean, bow and arrows, that's, that's two more inventory, inventory slots to take up that uh, I just want to be able to grab as much stuff as I possibly can when going to the Black Forest and grabbing Burial Chambers items. I did bring a torch. I don't usually bring that, but since for YouTube, you know, I might get all dark. What I should have done? Oh, man, you know what? I should have gotten a club. I'm actually going to go back and grab a club, because that would be, oh, uh, I got a skelly boy right here. Because I really, I should start getting my club skill up, and, um, skeletons are weak to clubs. So I'm going to go grab, that, that's, uh, something I forgot, so let's go grab a club and I'll uh, come back. Alright, dude, so we got our club. It's the beginning, of, beginning of day 15. Upgraded it to tier 3. It just takes bone fragments to upgrade. But let's get back in here. Probably take out this deer first. Get this deer. Bonk, got him. And let's get back into this black forest. Alright, dudes, back at the burial chambers. Let's go. Let's get in here. So it's always just it's, it's always a good idea too. Whenever you're going out and you know grabbing resources, farming, have a good idea of of what you want to grab. Of, you know, like I, I don't need resin or anything like that, so I'm not gonna pick that crap up. But have a good idea. I'll just uh, put the torch on now because it's gonna I know it's gonna be dark. Nope, missed. Oh, you got me. It's all good. It's just, uh, carrying him. Bonk, bonk. Got him. Yep, improving that club skill. Skilly boys are weak to clubs. Or blunted attacks, so there we go. There's a boy in here. Took him out. Anybody else hanging out in here? Okay. And we yellow, yellow mushrooms. Let's see. Some more yellow mushrooms over here. Let's see. Looks like there's a skeleton spot. Nice cer first certain core. Heck yeah, let's go. Start going ham. Just whacking. Get rid of this freaking skeleton spawner. Skelly boy's in here. Got him. Nice. Anything on the ground? Usually there's like stuff on the ground sometimes. So I already got this elder boss location on the map. It's gonna take all this junk. Nice. Decent amount of certain cores. Heck yeah, some rubies that we can give to the trader. Let's keep going. Alright, going in the middle area. Let's check it out. Can we hang out? Yep, this guy. Okay, whacked him. Let's leave that open. Okay, it's a door there. Check out what's on behind this door. Alright, nice. Looks like uh, nothing. And go ahead and check out this last area. I'm um, Skelly Boy. Bonk. Gotcha. Okay, got some bone fragments. Pick those up. A couple of yellow mushrooms. Okay, nothing back. Oh, got a spawner back here. Let's go ahead and take this out. Got a uh, one star boy. Okay. Take out that evil bone pile. Put a torch on. I don't think there's anybody else back here. And already got that. All right, take all this crap, bunch of rubies and ambers and stuff. We can sell to the trader. 
Nice. Cool, keep going. Alright, I already, I already know there's some boys behind here, so I'm gonna take out Stag Breaker. And just start whacking them. Yep, just start whacking the crap out of them. Still getting damage indicators. Maybe not anymore. Okay, that guy, whoever's who's behind there is freaking dead. Check out what's back here. Nothing, just a bunch of yellow mushrooms. Alright, I think that's our first dungeon down. Alright, dude, so one dungeon down, just check out our loot. I don't need that crap. Seven certainly cores, it's pretty decent. And some other junk. So what I can do, just so put an X on this. That burial chamber is done, and we will go to the next one. Coming up to our second burial chambers. Let's check it out. Hopefully there's a bunch of certainly cores in here. That'd be really cool. That'd be super duper cool. And you got some yellow mushrooms. Looks like we got a few entrances. I think I will go to the left first. Let's get a torch out. Okay, we got a door here. Let's get the club ready to go. Hey, looks like nobody's back here. Let's pick up these yellow mushrooms though. Get some there's like there's some recipes that you can use those. That are good. Okay, go over this way. Everybody hanging out back here. Nope. Uh, some yellow mushrooms again. Gonna grab them. Let's see. Check out what's behind this door. Yep, there's some boys. Yep, there's some boys. A few boys. Take out this guy. Whack these guys. Yep, you're done. Just whack them. Got the old club. Get that club skill up. I'll probably just fight Bone Mass with a wooden club. Not bothering making a freaking iron club for that loser. Or bronze club, screw that. Yeah, let's keep going. Looks like that was that side. And then it's got this last area over here, let's go check it out. Hopefully this side has like a bunch of certain cores. Probably just go behind this door first. And check out this area. Anything back here? No. Check behind this door. Bunch of doors. Oh no, that's what I'm gonna do here. Take out Stag Breaker, close the door, and just dunk on him. It's kind of cheap, but whatever. I don't care. Let's take him out from behind the uh, safety of the door. Bonk. Guys are dead. Oh, there's another. Uh, oh, let's do two star boy. Nope. Nope. Closing the door on that guy. No thanks. I will just take this guy out from behind this door. And then immediately go in and try to take out that spawner. Yep, just whacking him. Stag breaker for the win. Oh, it's like super, super dark. Get some more food going. Okay, we're going in. Just whacking the crap out of this. Yep, we're gonna get hit a couple times, whatever. Take out these losers. Nice, they're done. You're dead. Okay. Get cool in here, take all this junk. Don't need that. And got some certainly little certainly core room back here. Any more uh anything on the ground? Let's take the torch out. Yeah, a bunch of certainly cores back here. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. Awesome, got some coins. Take all this junk. Heck yeah, should be able to get that belt. I think this episode go to the trader. I think we'll have enough um, to trade in to get that, but I think that is this uh, is another dungeon down. All right, next dungeon coming up. Got some boys hanging out outside. Slap them a couple times. Slap. Where is the entrance? Right here. All right, nice. Okay, so how many? We got five minutes left on our rested buff. That's okay. Let's head on in here. Hope for a bunch of certling cores. Give me a bunch of them. Okay, I see a skelly boy right there. Okay, I got him. Let's just go this way then if there's a already a skeleton back there. Alright. Bonk. Grab that. Let's see. Anybody hanging out back here? Nope. 
nobody chilling. Okay, so that's that middle area down. Got some of these yellow mushrooms around here. Go to our left. It's like a couple uh, areas. I think I see some uh, skelly boy right here. Take him out. A couple of boys. And Perry both there. Losers themselves. Nice. Get the torch out. Okay. Some more goodies. No certainly cores. Ah, there's one. Let's say no certainly cores back here, man. Lame. There's that area. Let's check out what's to our left. Ain't nobody here. Take all that. Is there nobody up? Oh, a little certainly. Sneaky certainly core at the top here. Okay. And go across. It's like, look, looks like, like the last area back here. I think we'll, let's go to our left first. Check out this open area. Nothing here. Lame. Check out what's behind the door. Nobody. Okay. And then this last little spot here. Got a archer. Got him. Ain't nothing back here. Ooh, some boys. Yep, this is what we're gonna do for these guys. Take out Stag Breaker. And just take them out. Okay. Oh, Ghost. I'm just gonna power through this. They don't hit that hard. I'm just gonna freaking whack them with the spear. Bonk, gotcha. Not bottom, I'm trying to parry him. Just whack him. Okay, I got some certainly cores back here. Rubies. Nice. Got a pearl. Definitely gonna hit up the trader. Most definitely. Look what's going on back here? Goodies. Boys. Okay, now another door. Here we go. Didn't parry him, it's alright. Skeleton. With some yellow mushrooms. Nice. Some certainly cores too. Awesome. Heck yeah, let's go. Heck yeah, dude. Take the torch out. And we got another door back here. Oh, yep. Check this out. Just gonna be cheap. That's why Stag Breaker is really freaking nice. You can just be cheap. Be cheapo like this. Yep, okay, let's take out the spawner. Take out the evil bone pile. Nice. And you can like leave those things and farm a bunch of uh okay, I got one star boy right here. Who's not paying attention. Eh, you kinda hit a little hard, but it's alright. Yeah, you can like leave those and farm bone fragments, but I've never really felt the need to do that. Got another door. Leading to nothing. Alright, that is another dungeon down. Alright, dude, so it's actually raining outside, but it's all good. You can you can put a campfire down in these um, burial chambers, and that will actually give you the uh, your rested buff back as well. As long as there's no enemies in the area, but if you clear it out, you know, you lose your rested bonus. You just put a campfire down inside, bam, get your, uh, get your comfort level 3 bu uh, rested buff back, and keep on keeping on. Okay, coming up on the last burial chambers that I found in this area what I'm gonna do quick is let's see I just need a okay I just need some wood so right I'm just gonna get rid of this west the uh, sorry this uh this wet debuff and I just need a couple of wood for it that's all good just grab it quick just be able to grab like the, whack these bushes Honk. okay go in the burial chambers we just sent down this campfire. Boom. And get rid of this wet debuff. And I don't think I need stone or wood anymore. Let's get our let's get our um, weapons out. Ready to go. Okay, cool. Looks like we only have a one of ways in front of us and to the right. All right. 
Let's check it out. Okay, we got a guy right here. Take him out. Yep, you're done. We have all these goodies. Okay. That's that area down. Looks like there's a little area to our left over here as well. Check it out. Okay, cut two doors. Alright. Check out this area over here. Alright, nothing. Lame. Let's get some more food. And got some. Got a certain core back here. Nice. Let's go back this way. Alright, that's our starter area. That's empty, already went over here. Okay, cool. So this area is clear. Check out over this way. See what's going on. And nothing over here. And what about behind the store? Any losers hanging out? Wanna get freaking slapped? Slap the old club? Wow, nothing. Wow. One certainly core, man. That is horrible. Okay, guys, back at the back at our base, and from four burial chambers, right? We got 21 certling cores, so pretty decent. A bunch of coins, rubies, and amber and crap like that. Yellow mushrooms, a bunch of bone fragments. So that's just our haul from that. I think I might do know that do now though is uh, get some of this crap put away. Uh, grab our coins and rubies and junk and then head up to the trader. See if we can get that belt Almost at the trader. Let's look at our torch because it's dark Here we go in a little trader bubble Got Hallstein It's cool little locks, bro And let's talk to Haldor. So what we can do is sell sell all of our junk and How much coin do we have? Nice, let's do it. Just got enough to buy it. So, Thor's belt. Got it. Totally awesome. Actually, put it here. Nice, so that increases our um, carry weight by 150, which is amazing. Getting it this early in the game, it's super cool. Let's get on out of here. Alright guys, so I just did a little bit of uh, grinding. In between there, got a nice little storage solution now. Since we're really running out of space inside our six little chests in here that I had. Running out of room, man. It's had too much crap. So what I've done is uh, made this little simple storage solution. Um, a bunch of chests. There's some on top and then around here. It's just kind of cool like with the, you know, little, um, what are these things called? The poles in between them. So that's my storage solution for that. Um, I got some stone over here. You, you can just like, like these stone piles. I can, yeah, these stone piles. You can just like, you can get them really close to each other and kind of clip into each other. So you can just stack stone really easily. Got a couple of char charcoal kilns going, making coal, so that we can uh, really start jumping into that bronze age, which is what we'll get to on the next episode. So next time, next episode will be grabbing tin. So I'm gonna do a massive tin run along the coast here. Grab a bunch of tin. And then once I get about probably up 120 to 150 tin, probably like 150, we'll uh, start hitting these copper deposits over here that are close to us. Get three copper deposits, and then really just jump into the iron, uh, the bronze age. I might actually um after that's done as well, go after these burial chambers here too because that's just an easy, super easy way to get a bunch of certling cores. I want like a ton of certling cores just so I can uh, get a decent amount of furnaces and charcoal kilns and also. A ton of portals as well. That's just another thing I want to get is uh, starting getting portals. But we'll do that in the next episode. Thanks for watching, guys. Leave a like if you liked it. Subscribe if you want to see more. And I will catch you guys later.